Hello and welcome to this deep core focused class. All you need today is yourself, your beautiful body and a yoga mat. Whenever you're ready, go ahead and lie down on your back. Your feet are flat on the floor about hip distance apart and then reach your arms up above your head. Take a slow deep inhale through your nose and as you exhale, curl up, bring the arms forward and then lower back down. Deep inhale, exhale. Breathe in and out. Really start to find that contraction right from the beginning. We're just warming up here, finding that connection with our core, bringing our focus, our attention to it. Breathe in and out. In and out. Let's do two more here. Last one. Keep your chest lifted, little crunches up and up. Little lift, lift. I'm pulling my belly button in a little tighter, trying to lift those shoulders off the floor a little higher. Let's do four. Three, two, one. Hold it here. Hands come behind your head. Right leg extends straight. Now pull the knee in and out. Pull it into your chest, extend it back out. My elbows are wide. I'm not pulling on my neck. Take it in, out. Let's do four more. Last two. Last one. Let's add a twist with the upper body. Twist, back center. Twist, back center. I'm bringing that left elbow to meet the right knee. Twist, back center. Twist, back center. We have four. Three. Two. Last one. Hold that knee in. Reach our left arm across. Little crunch. Crunch. Yes. Up and up. Keep that right knee stacked right above your hips. Up, up, lift, lift. Right elbow is open. Let's do eight more. Six, and then we switch sides. Last four, three, two, one. Come back to center, left leg is long. Pull the knee in and out. Pull and extend. Keeping the upper body still for now. If you need to modify, you can always rest your head and jump back in when you're ready. Take it in, out, in, out. Make each and every move nice and controlled. Do it with an intention. Yes, in, out. Let's do four, three, two more, and we'll add the twist. Last one, let's add the twist. Twist, back center. Right knee to left, right elbow to left knee and back to center. In, out, in and out. Let's do four, three, two, last one. Hold the knee in, reach across with your right arm, little crunch, crunch, up and up. Try to get that left shoulder blade off the floor. We have eight, six, four, three, two, one. Hands come behind your head, both knees come in. Legs extend on the diagonal and then bring them back in. Extend them out, take them back in. Make sure you're keeping that core control here and that connection. If your low back is starting to lift off the floor, take your legs a little bit higher up towards the ceiling. Find your range of motion, find what works for you and for your body. Yes, take it out and in. Last one, and you have the option to add the upper body. Arms reach above your head and then curl into a tight ball. Take it out, in, out, 
in. Try to lift those hips when the knees come in to add a little lower body curl. Out, in, out, in. Yes, let's do four. Three, last two, and last one here. Yes, oh, rest your head. Give yourself a nice big hug here. Deep inhale and exhale. And then take your legs out a little longer, flex your feet, really press the weight into your heels. Arms come above your head. And on your exhale, roll yourself all the way up, finding that nice straight spine. Arms are long. Deep inhale. As you exhale, curl your spine, really pull that navel in, and then come back up. So come down and up. Arms reach forward, arms go above your head. Yes, find that deepest position here. If this is uncomfortable on your shoulders, keep the arms a little lower. Or maybe you're just holding them in front of your body. Let's do two. Last one. Stay low, pull your right knee in, extend it out. Pull it in and out. Yes, in, out, in, out. We have four, three more, two, last one, other side. Left knee comes in, out, pull, press. Keep this strong flex in your foot. Take it in, out, pull, press. Yes, I know it's getting hard. Hang in there, we got this. We have four, three, two, last one. Lower your left foot down, twist over to your right, come back through center, take it to your left. Again, right, back center, and left, back center. Right, and left. Let's do four, three, two, last one. Stop at the center, drag your right heel in, press it out, now left heel, press out. Yes, drag right, and left. Really try to press it down into the floor. Right and left. Let's do four more. Three, two, last one. Now lower yourself down on your forearms. Beautiful job. Bring those knees back into your chest. Toes are pointed. Now open the legs out to the sides. Extend them straight, bend and close. Open, extend, bend, close. Option to stay here or start taking it a little bit lower. Take it out, extend, bend, and close. Open, extend, bend, and close. Find that low diagonal as you're extending the legs straight out. Let's do two more. Last one. Hold the knees in, lower yourself down on the mat. Legs come up towards the ceiling. Knees are softly bent. Angle your knees towards your right. Lower up curls. Little curl, curl. Up, up. Trying to poke the ceiling with my toes. And other side, up, up. Knees are angled towards your left. Four, three, two, one. Come back to center, up and up. Lift and lift, yes. Make sure you're breathing through each and every movement here. Let's do eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one. Bring your knees into your chest. Give yourself that nice hug for one more time. Beautiful. And now extend your legs out on the diagonal. Keep your toes connected 
open the knees apart. Now lower down your right leg, lift it up. Lower left and lift. Lower right, lower left. The key here is to keep that core engagement. And again, so that the low back is not arching and lifting up towards the ceiling. Lower right and left. Right and left. Let's do two more. Last one. Hold the toes connected, curl up, reach through your legs with your hands, and now crunch up and up. Put a curl, curl. Make sure you're breathing. Exhale on every crunch. Exhale, exhale. We're so close. Let's do eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Rest your head. Take a slow, deep inhale here. And exhale. Beautiful. Then go ahead and turn yourself around. And we're going to finish it off with a plank series. So bring your elbows directly underneath your shoulders and then extend your legs straight behind you. Really pull that navel in. Find that one straight line from the crown of your head all the way down to your heels. So we're not hiking the hips up and we're not dropping the hips down towards the mat. And just find your breath here. Slow, deep inhale and exhale. Press yourself up and out of your shoulders. Find that best form. And let's pick alternate bending the knees. Bend your right knee, your left knee. Bend right and left. Tiny little bends, keeping the hips still. And now let's take it across, across and across. So bring your right knee towards your left, left knee towards your right. Yes. Bend and bend. Little twist and twist. We're so close. Let's do eight, seven, six, five, four more. Three, last two, and one. Beautiful. Lower yourself down on your knees and then shift that seat back. Come into a child's pose. And let's take one final slow deep inhale. And as you exhale, carefully press yourself up. And that is it. We are all done with this short core workout. You guys did amazing. If you enjoyed it, please give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. And if you want to join my live stream classes, be sure to check out the link in the description bar down below. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next video.